what is up channel back at it and i'm very excited because i was scrolling through my brand i was scrolling through my youtube channel and i came to find out that today will be my 50th video five zero guys i remember when i first started this channel and i didn't know how to use a computer i didn't know how to record on my phone i was like how am i gonna edit how do these people find this the the software to edit and um, come to find out it was pretty simple man it was very hard at first but i i, I stuck with it i i failed i tried i spent hours and hours on preparation for these videos and now i'm getting the hang of it has as a as a man i could say i'm confident now that that i've progressed in my youtube if you go back to my first my first video it's crazy how bad that that video was <laughs> it it was like i was holding a camera from like the 1975 or something and it, it was just the worst video quality you could ever see and, and i didn't really have no direction but now 50 videos later, I've I personally, uh, I am proud to say that I've stayed committed and, and I know 50 videos is not a lot, but it is a lot when you consider the amount of, of video and, and retaking and editing and it's, it's hours of hours and it takes up your whole day really. And uh, so, you know, hours and hours and, and it, it's just a great, it's a great feeling that that you put in the work and for me i'm i'ma make as, as enough videos as i need to to grow this brand um so i want you i want you guys to understand that i'm very grateful if you guys are watching my videos i know uh, right now i'm sitting at 17 subscribers but to me it's not about the subscribers guys i, I want to bring value i want y'all to stick with me through these videos i want you to just stick with me through this journey um, and I, I'm just going to be consistent in the process to create a, a really great YouTube channel where you guys can go and, and find uh, inspiration, find ways to be more productive in your life. And that's the whole reason of this, this channel, guys, is to help. I want to bring value. And without further ado, I'm blabbing on too much. Let's get to the gym. So guys, just got out the gym, did an hour sesh. Today I actually hit uh, some muscle groups. I hit my chest. Um, I felt like I needed to work more on, on the weight today. Um, I don't know, I'm just I'm just addicted to lifting the weights, man. I'm addicted to the gym and and sometimes I I do what the body tells me. But we're feeling good. We're feeling good. I wanna I wanna talk about this because this is pretty amazing um now that i've years passed i, I see the progression and I'll, i guess i, I want to show you what my uh physique when i first started working out and i think i think i should the picture should be right here as you can see i was a scrawny little little kid just trying to 
just trying to make it, man. And I was uh, I was scared to go in the gym. I was weak. Uh, I was afraid of what people thought of me. I was doing everything wrong. I wasn't stretching. Uh, I wasn't warming up. And I just had a, the worst form it, <laughs> that you could ever think of. And people helped me along the way. I, I've researched a lot. And uh, I just I just weighed myself today. As you can see right here, this picture I got, I'm at almost at 165. Uh, it fluctuates between 164 and 165. And, and to come from like 125, um, actually I was like 120 at one point, um, 122. To come from 122, 125 to 165, and I'm still going up weight. Sometimes I'm at 166. It's just amazing, man. And and to me, I, I'm not, you know, I'm not one 220 pounds all muscle, but for me, I think my goal is to get to one 176. And, and stay there all lean muscle i think uh, i look pretty fit enough and if you add like 11 more pounds on me of muscle i think that's enough for me guys so y'all gotta you guys got have to set goals and it takes years man it took me at least six months to start seeing results um i worked out five days a week i was stuffing everything that i could stuff in my body just to gain a pound and and i worked hard man i i i, I uh I bled for for my physique, for the the strength that I have now, from from lift from barely li could lift a bar on bench, now to to uh, the last time I maxed out 225 was probably a year ago, but now I'm at maxing out 185, 190. That's a lot, man. That's progress. You know, I'm not I'm not benching 400 pounds like these crazy bodybuilders, but it don't matter to me, man. I, I'm not I'm not trying to I'm not trying to be the strongest. I'm not trying to be the fastest. I'm just trying to be the best I can be, the best physique that I can be, and 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 reaching that potential. So, uh, I hope I hope this guy this uh little rant uh, gives you motivation to get in the gym. And it, it is gonna be hard, you know. It, it's hard. It took me it took me a long time to to get results. But you gotta stick you gotta stick with it, man. The the best things in life take time. And they're the hardest things to get. Um, so let's get back home and, and get this breakfast. All right, guys, we are wrapped up for today. I want to end my video on this note. Um, this video is more for appreciation to you guys. I wanna I wanna give you guys all the credit um, because I wouldn't be able to get up and, and motivate myself to make a YouTube channel without knowing that that you guys are, some of you guys are watching me. I know it could be one, I know it could be two. It doesn't matter. God has put purpose in my life and, and he's put goals in my heart that I intend to achieve to the fullest extent. Remember, you guys are not your success. You're not the things you own. All this, all this stuff that, that I have, this amazing apartment, um this these blessings this these resources uh, it's not because of me it's because <clears throat> god is a god of grace he's a god of, of abundance <clears throat> and when he we set when he sets purpose in your life he he's not gonna just let you throw you out into the water <clears throat> he's gonna give you he's gonna give you all the resources you need but but it's your job to do what you what you need to do with those resources most people they they get they get this laptop they get this apartment they get the car and then and then they don't they don't need God no more and they 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 push them away because they they think that they got it with their own strength and 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 that's when you start falling man don't make that mistake you're you're not you're not you're not nobody you're nobody you're you're no more than than the the person next to you. And then we we been called on this earth to to love God and to love others as God loves you, and and that's my purpose in life. Some some of you guys have have will manifest that purpose different ways, man. Some some of you guys are called to be doctors. Some some of you guys are called to be engineers, scientists, astronauts. Whatever God has called you to do, whatever He's put in your heart whatever makes you happy then but you guys gotta do you guys gotta max that out to the fullest extent 
and then don't care about if you're not seeing results right away, if you're not where you need to be and you work so hard and you're consistent. And it's all in God's timing. He, he's doing things because he has a master plan. He's a master craftsman. He put you on this earth not to be an accident, but because he knows how your life is gonna be. He knows the end. He knows how you're gonna leave this world. And we gotta take into account that we're gonna have to meet him and we're gonna have to take account on 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 if we, we knew his son, not did you not did you get that much money did why didn't you get this much followers? Why didn't you get that car? No, he's not gonna ask you about that. He's gonna be like, Did you know did you know my son? Did did you did you follow me as as your father? Did did you do the things that that were most important? Love me and love others. Show show the world who I am through your life. That's that's what ultimately I believe that he's gonna he's gonna ask. So that motivates me. And and like I said, it's crazy to to see now that like I'm 50 videos in. I did, when I first started, I didn't even know how I was gonna make one. And uh, I just stayed consistent and 100 videos are to come, then 150, 200. I, I'm working more on quality, but I do put consistency first because I just wanna show you guys that I'm serious in the process that whatever whatever video is gonna be the video where, where I'm gonna reach that goal, I don't know. But the only way I know is if I keep posting, posting, posting. And, and I just stay, I stay true to the process that God has put in my life. And that's what I intend to do to the fullest extent. And then until the day I die, you know. So I hope these videos are bringing value. Like I said, I appreciate everybody that likes, shares, comments, supports. It's, I, I'm, I'm super humble in my life. And, and I just want to show you guys that if you put your mind to anything, it can be done with the grace of God. So, like I said, dive in your purpose. Don't don't run to it. Dive into it. Till the next time, guys. Till the next time. Peace out.